superstars who aren't exactly technical masterminds. He came up. He just created. Submission match strategy. Attack a body part. Lock him down of harm's way. Senses. This crowd is on pins and needles. Oh, what a really great out of that one. This could mean trouble. Saxon, you better not be chanting during this theme. Kurt will come out here and slap the taste out of your mouth. Boy, he likes it when you chant. It's a submission match. That means the only way to win the match is to make your opponent submit. You have to target a body part, right, Corey? Yeah, you got to be incredibly focused on a particular body part and continue to target that body part so that when you apply your submission, your opponent is already hurting. If you have an injury already, you have to be careful your opponent does not initiate contact and expose that weakness. Well, a competitor can always call an audible during combat. And attack whatever injury presents itself. Remember, you can only win via submission. And here's Randy Orton. Look at this display of power! Orton looking on his game right now. Ouch. A neck breaker. Really just laying it in. Elbow drop. Piercing. Orton measuring him. A knee smash. He's absorbed some damage already. I suspect this is all part of the process, guys. I don't think he'd tap now, but this certainly lays the foundation for a tap out in the near future. Randy Orton dismantling. Things are playing out exactly how he envisioned. I got right to the gut. Byron, some say you don't have to be well-versed in submission moves to have a chance to win this type of match. Do you agree? Well, the odds are not necessarily in your favor, but we have seen in the past superstars who aren't exactly technical masterminds win submission matches. And the only submission that matters is the last one. You can attack that limb any way you want beforehand. In fact, the match is no disqualification, so the options are endless. Got the leg. What dragon screw. That'll destroy a knee. Over 15 years into his WWE career, there were a few firsts left for Randy Orton to conquer. But he found one when he beat Orton and captured the United States Championship for the very first time. Whoa, Angle dodged that one. They still got it. Michael mentioned Randy Orton's United States title win and Shane Orton form. It came out of nowhere. After a quickly intensifying rivalry, the Viper beat the glorious one at Fastlane for the one title he had yet to claim. In the process, Orton became a... Great. He just created a prime opportunity. Does Orton even know where he is? Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. Submission match strategy. Attack a body part. Lock in the submission. Get your opponent to tap. Randy Orton looking at this. An RKO from out of nowhere. Now that is the kind of move that wins matches. This is Randy Orton's chance. 
and he finds a way free. Wow, that was just pure determination, Cole. German suplex. And Randy Orton just slips out of harm's way. Thunderous powerbomb. Uh-oh, no, don't do this, don't do this. Wow, part of me 
thought he was going to tap, Cole.
right there. Do it. Yet another big move, guys. Wow, he escapes it. He's just got no quit in him here tonight, Cole. Orton looking on his game right now. An impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. seen Randy Orton this effective from above the mat. Could this be a new dimension to his already lethal offense? Oh, look out! Missing drop kick finds its mark. Ooh, that kick! Here it comes. Stay away from the worm. Oh, and he releases the hold. Wow. Part of me thought that was it, Cole. Randy Orton, no problem in getting out of that one. There you go. The Viper getting absolutely pounded right now. Kurt Angle can draw the curtains on this fight.
Randy Orton, no problem. Another win on the resume. Guys, I think we may need to check the authenticity of Angle's Olympic gold medal after a loss like that. That was embarrassing. Don't be ridiculous, Corey. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.